Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Zuhu Mail to Apple Mail in 2024. So today, we're simplifying your email experience by connecting Zuhu Mail to Apple Mail. This integration ensures that you can manage your Zuhu email seamlessly within your Apple Mail client. So stick around as I guide you through the step-by-step -step or steps to connect Zuhu Mail to Apple Mail in 2024. So. Let's see, make your email management even more convenient and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we will have to go and log in into your Zuhu Mail account. To start, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case, could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, go to this URL section and just type Zuhu mail and hit the enter button this should take you here click on this first link and here you will be taken to zuhu uh, mail of course so you can click on access zuhu mail to access it and make sure to log in into your account if you have an account if you don't you'll have to log in into or to create a new account if you don't know nothing about zuhu mail you can scroll down to read more information about us in their home screen see even the uh, frequently asked questions if you have one of those questions i'll just open the answers and here you can pause the video and read the answers by your own. So yeah, for me, as you can see here, I'm already logged into your account. If you're interested about the pricing, here's it. You can pause the video and read it all again by your own. And for me, I'll just go here and click on access Zuhu mail right away to access my account. So here, as you can see, this is going to be my inbox and this is going to be my dashboard. So here of course we can start by enabling the emap access emap access which is in turn is message access protocol allows synchronization between different email clients so you can navigate into your mail settings sections and settings and enable that so where you'll find settings of course so first of all let me just go and use the nice mode i don't like things bright and now of course, if you go here to your account at the top right corner, you'll find here my account, enable mail hosting, sign out, available online, whatever you want. And as you can see, you can get the desktop app on Windows, Mac, or Linux, and follow. you can follow them however you want on their social media, of course. So you'll find settings here, as you can see, below this. So this is my profile. As you can see below it, you will find the settings right here. So go and click on that. This should open this here for you. Of course, you can go into this integration here and look as an example for uh, the Apple Mail, by the way, and here. Or, so as an example, if we go in here and click on create an extension, we'll have to do some stuff. But what we need is, as we said, is to enable this AMAP. Sorry, not here. We would want to add an EMAP account. So to get this EMAP, you'll have to go and upgrade a plan. Without it, you will not be able to. You can get, uh, add some uh, mail accounts, for example. In the settings, as you can see, you can check for e emails every 20 minutes, whatever you want, maximum emails to do. That does not matter. What we want, of course, as we said, is to add a new EMAP. So of course, if you want to add this POP3, You'll be able to connect with Outlook, Office, Zuhu, or even others, as you can see. But if you want to add the Apple Mail, you will need EMAP. POP3 will not be allowed. But to access or use EMAP, you'll have to go and upgrade your plan, as you can see. So you will have to enable the EMAP access to connect first of all to the Apple Mail. So you can find here some add-ons if you want, want to add them like personal storage, plan details, view order, and source pane. Then you will be able to add your EMAP in here. And with this EMAP, you can connect your Apple mail right away. As an example, if you want to check if there are if this, if there's Apple mail here in the extensions, let's just check it out. Why not? As an example, click on install from marketplace and here, just let's just look for um, Apple Mail. So as you can see, no extensions found. I'll just type Apple, why not? Hit the enter button. As you can see, there is no Apple Mail or something like that. If I type just Mail, 
I'll find some males, but you will not find Apple mail. So the only option if you're using just Duo mail is using this eMap option. But this eMap option will require, of course, an upgrade of plan. Of course, you can even here have some developer space if you want to, as an example. If you want to create a new extension, maybe you want to create an Apple Mail extension, you will be able to start by installing Node.js, install Zoho extension toolkit, then create an extension for Zoho Mail using Zen init uh, command and use Zen uh, Zit run uh, to run the extension locally, enable developer mode to test the extension, which runs locally, and then you can, of course, add maybe your Apple Mail if, into it if you want to. But if you want to just choose the extensions, as an example, so we'll just choose here non Zuhu apps and categories. It should be mail or CRM, maybe. Yeah, CRM, I guess. CRM will give you just the ones that. So, communication, maybe. Yeah, so basically, we'll not find it because we already checked all of them. But as I said, the only option is simply go and add your EMAP, add an EMAP account, of course. And here you can have the settings of that button. We would like to add a new one, EMAP. And you can even check if it's possible, like, can I connect uh, Apple Mail to Zuhu Mail? You can even check it before upgrading. So it can be easily added on either Mac or Windows. As people want to use Apple Mail on Mac devices for their work. So you can add Zuhu Mail to Apple Mail, a solution to move Zuhu to Mac. So as you can see, there isn't some article here, even without using uh, upgrading Zuhu. So you can do it from your Apple Mail. So make sure to follow this article, as you can see. It shows you how. And for, as you can see, Zoho, like, help, they shown you the EMAP configuration in Apple Mail. As I said, the, that's the option that I know to add uh, Apple Mail. And with that, you will need the EMAP access. Make sure the EMAP access is enabled. And to have it enabled, you will need to upgrade a plan because you will be able just to use the POP3, which is the normal one. And yeah, then you'll be able, as you can see, click on other email accounts, add your Apple Mail, and add everything that you want. As you can see, just do the things that they are telling you here. And yeah, you'll be good to go. So just even follow this article if you want, so if you have the email, if you don't, follow the article from before, which is uh, like this one. If you don't have the EMAP, if you want to do it from Apple Mail, and you'll be good to go. So that's going to be it for me today. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.